My name is Tom, and I choreograph Honesty. As a dancer who started his life in ballet, I like for people to see technique. I like for people to see artistry, but mostly I want people to see art on stage that they can relate to, that they can connect to. The focus is just really for, it's for the person watching. It's me giving myself to someone else. I don't want to be selfish or stingy in how I choreograph. I want to create something that allow someone to drift into a feeling or an emotion. Something that I think enhances what I do as a choreographer is I'm always listening and I'm always learning. I'm always watching and observing and applying to myself how can I take what I know as a movement artist and create the best product, something that really channels what channels what I can get out of dancers at its utmost and really channels how an audience relates to a work at their core. In the standing leg and let the hands just exist. So here, yeah. What I love about dance is when it's honest. One of my favorite stories, um, it's actually about my sister, and it's part of why I like creating art. My sister is a visual artist, she lives in Chicago, and when she was in high school, she was assigned this drawing project, and she had to go home and draw something and come back and talk about it. And everyone else came back the next day, and they had drawn these very morose, very upsetting things, and were like, this is my life in this moment, and you know, I really feel this deeply, and I had to draw this. And my sister came in with this beautifully drawn dog and said, I drew this dog because I really like dogs. And I find that story inspiring because art doesn't always have to be accessing the deepest, darkest emotions of your soul. It can access happiness and joy and excitement. And it can be something relatable, but still something that heightens the art. And so I like to draw dogs for a living. <laughs> 